All right, it's May 8th. Kind of a special video, uh, should be interesting. I uh, caught a swarm at work yesterday, May 7th, and I uh, luckily I, uh, I designed this, this uh, tote here where you can see I cut some holes in each side and I cut a window on top and I used window screen, siliconed it in and gorilla taped it in. Uh, reason being is I wanted something so if all the bees didn't go into the nuke box and they were bearded on the front, I could just pick up the whole nuke box and drop it right in there, lock it up. And it's a good thing I rushed and did this last night because when I got there in the morning, um, come to find out there was still probably maybe 500 bees on the front of the nuke. You couldn't even see it. So basically I had to spray it down with sugar water, pick them up, put them in here. And about every two and a half hours I came and I dropped some uh, syrup through the top, right on top of the, the nuke. Kept them busy once in a while, spray them down with sugar water. It seemed to keep them pretty at bay. And uh, we're gonna go in now. So I'm estimating this swarm here was a large swarm. Could be 15, 20,000 bees. Definitely wasn't 10,000 because they didn't even fit in a five frame nuke. So I'm gonna open this up. We're gonna start transferring um, some uh, cone, cone in there and uh, see if I, uh, I got them both in the shot. So you're gonna watch me transfer them off and uh, we're gonna see how everything is. I'm gonna get my sprayer ready in case they start coming out. I wanna spray them down. already see there's a lot of bees so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a couple frames in here and uh, I guess I'm gonna start trying to get some bees in there so here we go as you can see the box is still bearded, hopefully. And look at all the bees we got here. So we got quite a few bees. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna put them down and let them walk right into the hive. So I'll start getting open up this nuke. There's a lot, a lot of bees here. So let me see if I got that in view. Uh, you can see, if you can see all the bees bearded on the box. Let me readjust it. And we're gonna open up this nuke box and see what's inside. All right, it seems to be more bees on the outside of the box. Let me get a few frames in there. Look at that, already built out some comb. Alright. Let's just get the rest of these frames in there. I don't know if the where the hell the queen is. Well, I guess we'll figure that out as we go.
got our eight frames in here. Now I want to see if I can get some more bees in there. There's a ton of bees. spray bottle. get my brush. I'm going to have to brush them in there. That's what I'm going to have to do. So let's get them in there. box. So we're going to get these in there. Now, this is a mess. Now we're going to try and get these in there. Lot of bees. So, that being said, put the second super right on, on clock it. Let me move the camera in. So yeah, we got a lot of bees flying around.
this bottled up so I can get the bees to settle down. So that's about where you're going on. As you can see, there's a lot of bees around here. Let me get the camera off of here. I'll pan around a little bit for you. So it was a mess. Uh, hopefully there was a queen in there. I mean, I still got bees all over the place. So I mean, they just got introduced. They'll probably settle down in a while. But I see no bawling anywhere. And they seem to be putting their rear ends up in the air and fanning. So tells me the queen's probably in the box. Some bees left in here. See, I'm gonna look in there just in case I see a queen. Uh, otherwise, uh, I think we're looking pretty good here. Hopefully they settle down, they like the hive. They got plenty of room. So I'm gonna end the video right here. At least I get a little bit more work to do.